Hi, I'm Tracy Kilpatty, the Senior Training Specialist with Explore, and today we'll be going through programming and planning in Playground App. In order to start using programming and planning on Playground App on an iOS device, you'll need to first log into Playground App with your service sign-in. Once logged in, you'll be able to see on the right-hand side the first option should say Programming and Planning. Once tapped, you'll need to log in with your educator details. If you previously logged in, you'll be able to tap your name as it appears and enter in your four-digit PIN. This will bring up programming and planning on your iPad. This should look very familiar as this looks like Playground Web, but now accessible on your iOS device. Your menu items will remain the same with any of your click and drag options now being a long hold and touch. You can scroll using your finger to drag and to click and drag any content in, it's a long hold, drag and drop. From programming and planning, you'll also be able to publish to parents or save as a draft, meaning that your work is accessible on any Playground app where you can log in. In order to navigate back to your typical Playground app, you'll need to use the back arrow in the top left-hand corner. Here, you'll be able to log into any room and make changes as needed in Playground app. Thanks for watching. For more tips and tricks, look out for more navigation content.